Anthocyanin is a natural pigment, one of a range of compounds in plants that keep their systems healthy and potentially ours too. Which veggie has the highest anthocyanin? Uh, the, the purple carrots are by far the best with that. They've got an amazing amount of anthocyanin. And when we do this, right. the, the colour just goes the whole way through it. When it comes to fruits, who's the superstar? The superstar is the, the Queen Gunnard plum. It's a, it's a wonderful plum. So it's not just an ordinary purple plum. This has got five or ten times as much of the purple colour in it. And you can see it in there. Lindsay and his team tested the effects of anthocyanins on rats, fattened up on a diet similar to thick shakes, burgers and fries. The body mass index of these rats is 25 to 35, equivalent to the BMI of most of the Australian human population. What's happening as a result of obesity in these rats' bodies right now? Blood pressure is going up quite dramatically. The heart function is going down. The liver function is going down. The abdominal fat pads increase. The hormones go up. The whole of the body is being affected, and that's characteristic of obesity. And it's all linked together by this inflammatory response. It's all linked together because the inflammatory response occurs in every organ. There's no organ that is immune from that. And then, after eight weeks, he added anthocyanin-rich juice to the food of half the rats. Much to my surprise, actually, we found that the anthocyanins in purple carrots, in queen garnet plums, in all of these things, completely reverse all of those changes. So we haven't changed the diet. They're still getting this high-carbohydrate, high-fat diet. And yet, with that intervention, all of those parameters that characterise obesity are back to normal. That's incredible. That is incredible. And you think, wait a minute, this is not the sort of billion dollar multinational company type product. This is a carrot, this is a plum. The results with rats have led to human clinical trials, which are now underway. <laughs>